because I, I, I have been accused of DWB and I am not getting pulled over for DWB driving while black. We'll sit that light. Will t- I'll make a right turn if I need to. <laughs> so you come up to the four way stop at a red light at four 30 in the morning. There's nobody around. Why can the autonomous vehicle not go? The autonomous vehicle does not have that problem. It can see another vehicle coming. Mm-hmm. It can go right on through the light. And I think that's, those are the kind of conversations that we need to start having because in the very, not too distant future, we're going to have AVs all over the place. You got a point. Cause as I think about it, if we wait, we need to start having these conversations now because if we wait until it's already going, now we're behind. Now we're reactive. I'm, I'm an advocate for let's start some of the testing now. So, you know, let's start seeing what happens when we let some of these AVs make a right turn on red when they're mm-hmm. not supposed to go, make a left turn. Let's start testing those ideas out. Let's start gathering the data so that our legislators can make some informed decision and not make some boneheaded one based off of feelings of what a human would, should do. Let's go off of what is the safe thing to do. Because I really do believe uh, an AV should be able to go around a school bus at the proper speed in the amount of time that it has time to react to a kid Mm -hmm. running out in the middle of the street. And I would be a lot more comfortable with an AV in that scenario rather than a human.